hello friends today in this tutorial i will be telling you that uh, how to get the youtube playlist information inside your node.js application using this module which is youtube playlist summary so basically it will help you to gather some uh, information about youtube playlist so it has got uh, 16 weekly downloads and here inside your let me just uh, first of all uh, go inside my node mo uh, node project this is a folder here if I open this inside command prompt and first of all I will be initializing this command which is npm init dash y so this will create a empty package dot json file after this we will install our module which is npm i youtube dash playlist dash summary so this is the name of the module just enter this command and it will install this module as a dependency inside your package dot json file so as you install this module guys you need to have a youtube api key so in order to get the youtube api key it is very easy so if you use any kind of google api you need to first of all get the api key so for getting the api key we can just go to google developer console so basically this is a platform where you can just create your projects and get your API key and the very first link which comes in which is goes to console.developers.google.com and here I have created some projects here you can see that and after creating a project go to your credentials here credentials and then you just need to get your API key so for this you also need to enable the YouTube data API version 3 so after enabling the API you just need to click on this option create credentials and then click on API key so it will create the API key for you brand new API key this is my API key you can see that you can just copy this so don't follow the, my API key this API key will be different for yours so don't copy this so as you can see that the module is installed let me just open this inside uh, visual studio code my text editor and uh, you can see that how to install this how to use this we can just copy this line here so inside your package.json file you will find this uh, dependency as a dependency you can see that youtube playlist summary and uh, now we will create our index.js file so we will first of all include this module youtube playlist summary and now in order to use this module we just need to create a config object so basically this will hold uh, some information about this module so inside this first is the google api key so the api key that you have created this is the api key so just copy this and he here you just need to paste it like this and the second option is that how what information that you want to get about the playlist so here inside this we need to get the published at title of the playlist description video id and video url so this is these are the options that you want to get so after your configuration object you just need to call this api so we can just write our third line of code copy this so we can just create a new variable ps and now we can just initialize this module playlist summary and we can just pass this config object so after passing this uh, we can just call a function here which uh, let me just write this ps dot get playlist item so this is the function guys so here it will get all the videos about a certain playlist so here you also need to provide a playlist id so so in order to get a playlist id it is very easy let me just first of all declare this so if you go to youtube let's suppose uh, I get my playlist if you if I go to my channel which is uh, coding Siksha and if I filter it by playlist here let's suppose type is equal to playlist so these are some of my playlist here let me just select this playlist view JS tutorial for beginners so this is a playlist you can see that playlist means that a series of videos which are there on YouTube you can see that it contains 26 videos and the ID is equal to this part this is the ID this is a playlist ID so I can just replace this value here like this 
copy this and now I can just pass this playlist ID to my function so this constant I can just pass here playlist ID so this returns a promise that we need to handle by dot then so inside this function it returns the data we can just console log the data for now and also in order to handle error we can just use dot catch so if any kind of error take place we can just have our error we can just console log the error just make it as error so basically now if I run this application inside my command prompt let's suppose I execute node index.js so you will see that it will contain it will return my JSON response here you can see that so now it will return all the information regarding this playlist you can see that it will return an array of uh, values here this is a URL of this playlist playlist ID it has returned and uh, part snippet contain details maximum result 50 you can see that so this is the information guys that you can return you can even have the channel ID as well uh, I think that this information that we have provided here the title of the playlist is also there you just need to um, the title is there of the playlist you just need to you can you can see that this is a full path of this playlist here all the information will be there inside this response you, you just need to check here this is a JSON response so in this way you can get any information regarding any playlist on YouTube using this module which is there inside Node.js similarly you can pass the channel ID as well so if I pass this channel ID declare this channel ID and similarly copy this and instead now I can just pass this channel ID and now if I run this once again node index.js and now it will return some information regarding the channel as well so you can see that so in this way you can just use this module which is a YouTube playlist I summary so to get the information regarding a playlist YouTube playlist or the channel as well so thanks very much for watching this video